Time now for Eyewitness News, call 12 for action. If you're thinking of picking up a few extra dollars in freelance work, you may find yourself bringing in more than just cash. Problem solver Susan Hogan shows us how. When you're a freelance worker, it's pretty easy to feel like you're on your own, but in reality, you are part of a huge and growing group of millions of people, and with groups comes a lot of advantages. For freelancer Joshua Warren, finding a steady stream of income wasn't always easy. It was very uh, hit or miss. It was a lot of word of mouth. This is a common problem for the 42 million independent workers in this country. That's roughly a third of the U.S. workforce, an area that's seen growth despite the recession. We expect that number to grow year after year because essentially people are working by putting together projects and gigs and jobs. And there's power in numbers. An increasing number of organizations are offering health insurance and other perks now. We want to make sure that people get the same kinds of protections that traditional employees get. That's why the Freelancers Union offers cost-effective retirement plans as well as dental, disability, and even life insurance. I started out on Odesk at $15 an hour, and now it's up to $95 an hour, and that is directly driven by the demand. These sites also act as virtual workspaces, complete with things like timesheets, status reports, and digital to-do lists. Some even make sure you see a payday. We guarantee payment whether we collect it from the employer or not. Now membership to this freelancers union is free. Now the organization we're told is actively fighting for things like unemployment insurance, payment protection, and fair taxation. And if you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our Call 12 for Action Center Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1. Our hotline is 228-1850. I'm problem solver Susan Hogan, Eyewitness News.